Hello everyone, so I am very your own Ashi Bansar from Nepal, Tarai region. Despite of not having the family background of doctors, I am greatly influenced by the nature of selflessness and their service. In my schooling days, I was a member of Scout. We used to go for camping, which was fun. So, and on, during camping, we noticed we we noticed that many people of uh, there were deprived of the health services, which used to make me really feel bad. I always wanted to help them, but could not, as I myself was not matured enough. So this became a dream, you know, to do. Then growing elder, the best interested way I got to knew to help them was by being a doctor. Then I moved to Kathmandu. I gave entrance and guess what? On my very first attempt, I got passed. Then I thought everything would go as I planned. But to my surprise, there was nothing as I planned. The actual struggle started after this. I could not get admission due to my own negligence. Then this was very soon to get disappointed. So I tried again to second attempt and again I got passed. But those days were very tough financially for me. On my second attempt, I decided to go to Bangladesh. Although I was not sure for that decision, I went. For some months studying there, after that, I thought, no, this was not what I wanted to do. Then I returned back, although being on Bangladesh was a lifetime experience for me. After returning back, I became blind and I further thought that what to do. I took some months gap, honestly. I took some months gap and then really frustrated and I saw dreams slipping out of my hands. Looking at my condition, my mom advised me to go on an outing with my friends. On that outing, suddenly I saw a boy who was injured just nearby me. This was really a life-changing incident for me. Then that boy, I didn't even think for twice and I went and helped that boy. Returning to home, thinking about that incident, I realized that I really want to do this because this gives me a feeling of satisfaction and happiness. And the struggle to my dream will be really worth it. So I really wanted to do that. Then keeping a strong willpower, I again appeared the entrance. And guess what? Again, I passed. Now I'm the student of Kathmandu Medical College. Though it's first year, but I'm really happy. And from my struggle, what I learned is that we should always keep a positive attitude. What I strongly believed is that uh, whatever happened, happens for the good, you know. Then I always think, thought of this thing when some unexpected thing happened to me. That like failing on the exam for twice, thrice, you know. So whenever I used to think this, that something good is waiting for me i used to move forward for success then every people in whatever field they are in their life they should always keep a positive attitude and this will help them a lot this i'm saying from my personal experience and now my journey has begun so whatever comes in my way to journey to white court i'm ready for that and i just need your luck thank you